Sunday nights and welcome back to another episode of Chrono Cross. Last we left off, we were told to go check out the tombstone over here at Cape Howell. So let's go do that. I want treasure. Electro jolt. Can you can you get out of the way? Thank you. A bone. Not. <clears throat> There's something written. There's some writing on the tome. Rip, our beloved Leonora, died age seven. Nobody can take away anything away from him. Nor can anyone give anything to him. What came from the sea has returned to the sea. So you must be the ghost of the boy who died ten years ago, Leonora. <gasps> How dare you! Don't move! Sorry, Junior, but we have no business with your friends. We're just after you. Be a good boy and come with us. But, Sir Karsh, do you think it is truly true that this chap is a ghost? He seems like a perfectly perfect young boy to me. That doesn't matter. We found the boy here just as he said we would, didn't he? Didn't we? Now seize him! Hold your seahorses! Who the? <clears throat> Out of the way, Missy. You don't want to get hurt now, do you? Shut your trap. You're the ones who'd better get out of the way. You have a problem? Do you have a shaken idea who you're dealing with, Missy? That's enough. Listen up, Junior. Our orders are to take you in. We don't want to hurt you. Just come with us. Or else this axe of mine will have to do the talking. For crying out loud, would you just shut up and get on with it? I'm going to kick your sorry arses so hard you'll kiss the moons. Fair enough. You leave us no choice. You'll regret this, Missy. Let's see, green, yellow, and yellow. Let's start with this one. Ah. Uh. Sir, his innately innate element color attribute is white. Right, that does it. Quick, attack him with the opposite element attribute color. Black. How unfortunately unfortunate. I do not seem to have any, sir. You nincompoop, you should always carry elements of every color. Then how about you there? I'm shaking in my shoes to tell you this, sir, but I don't have any either. We'll have to let you, Sir Car, show us how it's done. Useless fools, er, real men don't need magic when they can fight with their might. We're gonna go ahead and uplift you, Karsh. Fireball, magma bomb, fireball. Let's go ahead and just fireball to this guy. Oh. 
can't tell if he's super injured or what. The big, uh, the middle guy. Photon Ray. He's dead. Magma bomb. Oh, I should have defended. Oh. Are you serious right now? Oh. There we go. Ooh. Ow. Did you say you didn't need it? Die. Thank you. Hey, leveled up. Or, you know what I mean. Hey, got a bone axe. Sir Karsh, I say we shake it out. I'm out of here so that we can live to fight another day. These aren't no ordinary brats we're dealing with. Damn cowards. As for you, Missy, we won't forget this. Ooh, I'm so scared. I'll be happy to take you on anytime. Think I'll lose to scum like you? Ha! You all right, mate? Nod. Leonora. Your name's Leonora, ain't it? How'd you know my name? Oh, me? My name's... Kid. Call me Kid. Nice to meet you. I just couldn't stand by and watch those blokes gang up on you like that. They just pissed me the bloody hell off. I wish I could have beat, em, beat on them some more. But why was that mob after you? No clue. What do you mean you've never even met him before? Eh? Ah, forget it. Hey, Leonora, how about you and me team up for a while? That car fella ain't gonna just leave you alone, that's for sure. And to tell you the truth, I'm new to these islands. It's pretty lonely traveling around here on my own. <laughs> So how about it, Leonor? Maybe it was fate that we'd meet up like this. Refuse. Nah, I'm good. Hang on! Are you telling me you're gonna refuse the company of a lonely, vulnerable, sweet little girl? Yes. You sure there, mate? You might live to regret it, you know. No thanks. Sheesh. Well, have it your way, mate. Bye. There's a reason I rejected her. I'll be heading up north to a town called Termina. It'll be getting dark pretty soon. I suggest you go find a place to shack up for the night. Don't want you to become Hecran bait now. <laughs> well, see ya. <coughs> There's a very good reason I said no to her. It was terrible. They should be kind to animals. Hmm. 
Rise and shine, everyone. A new day awaits. I'm glad I found you here, though. Late all, right? Kind of feels odd calling you that. You know, I've been thinking. Maybe you had some kind of accident and it hit your head. That's why your memory's all messed up. You're really someone else, but you think you're the Leonora who died ten years ago. I want to help you. I can't just leave you alone like this. And you don't seem like such a bad person, either. You're planning to go to Termino, right? Then let me join you. I have some errands to run over there anyway. And to tell you the truth, it feels like I've always known you. Sounds strange, doesn't it? Well, that's that. Shall we get going? Lena, join your party. Now, if you had taken Kid, you can't get Lena. She's completely locked out to you. Okay, let's head to Termina. Push your shoe. Full speed ahead. And... Now that we have Lena, we can also get one more party member. We're gonna go down here. Remember Shark Fin Guy? Yeah, he worships a voodoo statue. Oh, hello there. I just finished praying. Here, take a look. It's called Mojo. It's a good luck charm from the Far East. Can you feel the love and affection oozing from it? It's just such an amazing messenger of love and courage. Think about it, my brother. How our, how our everyday lives are controlled by uncertainty and fear? I spent yesterdays in uncertain tomorrows. How we live a meaningless today. This holy item filled with prayers protects and supports us. Come, my brother, let us pray together and bring peace of mind to our hearts. Where can you find true love and peace of mind? Within Mojo! Hey. Here, have this. This is a tooth from a ferocious lion shark. And look at the size of this thing! Judging from the size, this baby must have been a good 15 feet. Don't tell me you're the one who caught it. What? What did you say? Another me? So the other me who became a fisherman asked you to give this to me? What are you talking about? That's enough. There is only one me. How could there be another me out there? Sure, there was a point in my life when I thought about becoming a fisherman. That was a good ten years ago. But I couldn't do it. I gave up on that gave up that path right then and there. I just gave up. I don't care what you say. This is the path, path I chose and I don't regret it. Besides, you can't just change the way you live in the blink of an eye. Now, would you please put that thing away and leave me alone? Alright. But first, I'm going to talk to your cat. Boogum! Hold on a second there. What was that? Love is always in the air. It's just that no one notices. You're Mojo? I am Mojo, and I bring good fortune. Boogum. This can't be happening. How the... I sense some kind of purpose. Seems like fun, so I will join you. Wait a second. There's nothing droll about me. Just a word of advice. Stop running and come face to face with your life. Er, messenger of love and courage I am. I'm lucky, I'm lucky, uh-huh, uh-huh. Mojo joined your party. Confirm. Now, you can only have three party members. I'm going to actually take Pulsual out and put Mojo, Mojo in. Mojo is not that good of a character, but... Uh, well, Poshul's just Poshul. Can I, I just realized I didn't... Uh, Poshul. I can unequip. Alright. You can have an ivory helmet. You can have an ivory helmet. Now... 
all elements, I guess. I'll do those. There we go. Okay. Oh, shoot. That's right. Um, let's give you that and that. You have a cure, have an aqua beam, have an ice lance, have an uplift, and a photon. And then Mojo, you're gonna get some later. But we now have three party members. Hello, can I interest you in something? Sure. How's my money looking? 1,000? Let's go ahead and buy one of these. One of these and one of these. Equip. Oh, or not equip. I have a cure. I uh, have an aqua beam and I have a fireball. Now, we can go to Hydra Marsh. Um, let me save right here. Just realize this is literally an emulator. to we'll take some poison damage going in the crazy walking around this forest without protective gear. I have an extra set with me. Take them. Um, this way you'll be able to walk through the marsh without getting hurt. Thank you. Oh, and watch out for monsters. Yay. Honestly, I just wanted these elements for Mojo. Just a tablet there. Don't know. It's my. Eh. I don't want to mess with that mobster. I don't know how strong they are right now. I do, however, want to see. I want to make this thing smack me. Wow, what is this frame rate right now? Are you alright, Landorum? Uh, the toxin levels seem higher here than at the entrance. The plants must have mutated. That's for later. Bushwhacker. 
Elements allocate. Yay! Yeah. Um, you know what? Aqua Beam can go here. There we go. Just wanted all those spells. Exclamation is nearly complete. Just stick to the low path and make your way through. We still have some men, some of our men working on the high ground, so do not interfere with their work. I've been attacked by a little pig thing. that one attack element photon ray wait okay I don't have a yeah actually you know what? let's use the electro jolt a new spell to fighting. Bushwhacker! Oh well. Ice Lance! Yes, by the way, Lena's weapon is a spoon. Hey, we got some fur. All right. We are investigating the supernatural phenomena out there. It's off limits to the. Hey, are you the exorcist we sent you for? Yeah, we are. Oh, great. I thought you'd be a little older. Please make your way up the rope ladder. Are you the exorcist? You're younger than I expected. Anyway, do you hear that howling sound from down yonder? All I want you to do is stop that noise. I don't believe in ghosts, but go do what you have to do. Hey, don't go down there. I'm the one that's going to get it from the boss if I let anyone down there. Plus, I really think there's a monster down below. I'm warning you! I'll be taking that. That's a monster. Nyeh, nyeh, nyeh. Looks like I'm causing quite a stir. I've been waiting forever for someone like you. Yeah, I know. You and I are both dead, eh? I don't know how I ended up like this. I don't have a body and I don't remember a thing. You understand what I'm going through, don't you? But I have a feeling everything will come back to me once I find my body parts. 
So how about it? Will you help me find my body? Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah? I'm heavier than I look, but I hope you don't mind. And don't swing me around too much. I'll start feeling nauseous. Okay. Skulls are not supposed to jump around. You must have used some kind of supernatural trick. Anyway, we'll take care of the rest, so please be on your way. Just send your invoice to the Viper Manor. Thank you. Glad that was taken care of. I wonder how Sir Karsh is doing. You know, with the Isle of the Damned instant and all. Uh, it's nothing. I didn't say anything. Let me through. Hey, look, the bird's angry at me. Hey, look who it is. Shake it! We can't shake it on back to the manor like this. We failed in our mission. That was awfully awful back there, Pepper. I want to rematch. By the way, do you remember what kind of outfit he was shaking? Hmm. Just something justly like that, Pepper. Oh, you remember. So he looked like that, huh? Actually, it is him, Pepper. So you're sure about that? Wonderfully wonderful timing, Pepper. Let's shake it. We're really going to shake it to you this time. This time I'll make I made sure to bring a black element with me, Pepper. Good work. Well, shake it on up and attack him with it. Affirmatively affirmative, Pepper. How about I just kill you? Turn black. Oh dear, dear. That was no black attack element you just used. It was a black element to make your foe more susceptible to attacks of the opposite color attribute. White, wasn't it? I'm afraid you're right. How terribly terrible. You did bring a white attack element with you, didn't you? If you didn't bring one with you, you're more stupid than I thought. Er, how awfully awful. I'm afraid I didn't, Pepper. Um... These guys are yellow element. Bushwhacker. Shake it. Pepper box. Ow. Slap him with the spoon. Wow. Ice lance! Go me. Retreat! Let's shake it on out of here. And it's terminal. Sorry, I'm totally out of bellflowers. 
There's a big ruckus down in Fossil Valley. Men from the Dragoons were setting roads, roadblocks up in the valley. I'll get some in a few days, so come back again then. You have my sincerest apologies. I understand we are here to protect you as the Kaishia's Dragoons. Those knights should be done with their work shortly. Oh, that's all right. I can get my flowers from other places, too. Never mind that. I haven't seen Karsh around here lately. How is he doing? Well, he said he was going ghost hunting down south. I'm just a private, so I do not know for certain, but I heard a rumor that Lord Viper ordered him to go. A ghost? Now that's something. I just hope it's not a sign of a coming disaster. If you ever see him, give him my regards. Um... Give me just a second. Where is... Okay, never mind. Uh, I will do that, and I will be back too. Okay, what I'm going to do is actually, uh, we'll cut right here and then we'll be back in just a moment. And we're back. Sorry about that. Now, oh, God, you're so low. You made me wait forever, make it a lovely lady like, aha, so that's it. I get it. This shield over here is your sweetie, eh? I'm right, ain't I? No need to be shy. I'm not so bold as to break up lovers' tender moments. I'm understanding. I'll wait until your little date's over. Well then, have a bloody good time. Um, okay. We're about to come to a branching point in the game. Uh, my, you folks are mighty anxious. Sorry, it'll be just a bit longer. I'll have these hot-baked viper churros ready in a jiffy. What's that? You don't know what viper churros are? First, grind down heckrin bones, add a little water from Water Dragon Isle, then wrap them with biba skin. You then add some sugar and spices, get steaming coals from Mount Pyre, and bake them. For the finishing touch, we even add the famed Dragon's Glory. How about that? Doesn't that tempt your appetite just hearing about it? It's a great day, and I've scored a good place to sell. They will sell like hotcakes today. Hey, it's the smithy. First, I want to go up to this area up here. Because... I want that. There's no reason not to equip this now. Bye. Hi. Welcome. This here is the official blacksmith of the Acacia Dragoons. We carry only the best goods. Come and take a look. Forge weapons. Okay, so we can make Copper Swallow. And that was the only copper thing we can make. Do you have any iron with you? We've been out of it for the longest time. We could make stronger items if only we had iron. make anything? No. Copper Glovia. Okay. Ah, how many times do I have to tell you? Didn't I let the customers back here? How many years have you been my wife? 
What's a big ape like you doing worrying about such trivial stuff? Don't you be cl complaining up the storm over just one or two customers coming to talk to you. There's not one or two, there's three! Ark, you'll never can the delicate heart of a craftsman like yours truly. I did not expect a layman like you to can what I'm saying, but the artist method may seem like it only seem only like physical labor, but it requires far more metro, mental prowess. Every time the hammer strikes, a wee bit of my soul goes with it. Ah, I guess what I'm saying is your soul is what makes the sword. So if you're standing there as yapping and distracting me, I cannot focus my soul into this deal. Do you can? If so, then get going. Okay. That guy behind you looks like he's pooping. Ah, uh, why can you li no leave me be? This sword is no good now. Time to start over. Just found something super. Ta-da! It's cool, ain't it? A shiny metal on my chest. It suits me perfectly. Okay. Yahoo! Hello there, come and see them for yourself. This is the prize of all prizes. A rare catch, a live mermaid. This is what you call a real, real treasure. Remember that, kids. Unfortunately, this wasn't isn't for sale. She's my most valuable item. So what do you think? This isn't some stuffed animal or anything. She's really alive. Her pure, clear skin like it's made from crystal. Her gem-like eyes. She is the ultimate collector's item. Phew! Nature's creations are indeed great. Such a beautiful thing. Is, that, is this thing really alive? Hey, come on, look over this way. Oh, how beautiful she is. Ouch! Yow! Hey, you. You think this is really fun? How would you feel if you were trapped in a tank like that, being stared at every day, huh? Yikes! It's Corcho! Run! Corcho, not you again. Don't you go bothering my customers. There's no place for the likes of you. Just leave. Ch shut up. What customers? You're selling a bunch of bull. Why didn't you keep the tank uncovered when I showed up? Hey, everybody, this shop's a bunch of baloney. Shut your mouth. Don't you say such ridiculous things. Get back to your demi-human friends. Heh, I won't take that from a sleaze bag like you. Hey, you're not, you guys, you're not from around here, eh? Don't you wander around too much or you're going to get burned. Watch your back. How long was that previous section? Okay. That's Korcha. He's from Gold Elf. I wonder why he hangs around here in Terminal all the time. You shouldn't mess with the likes of him. I tell you, he's nothing but trouble. I mean, you kidnapped a mermaid and threw her in a tank. He's probably nicer than you. What business brings you here? There are only shrines here. You shouldn't disturb the resting place of the brave. This is no place for outsiders to roam around. I don't mean to be harsh, but if you have no business here, leave now. So, she was out of flowers. That is unfortunate. Then let us pray without any flowers for today. Hmm? Is that a bell flower you have there? Would you be so kind as to give it to us? We need a bell flower for our prayer. 
Here you go. For free? Are you sure? I thank you for deeply. Please, let me offer you my gratitude as well. The souls that rest beneath this sword love this flower in life. That is why we always bring some when we pray here. Dario, here is the bell flower that you used to love so much. Soon the flower's seeds shall sprout, grow leaves, and bloom flowers everywhere. We shall age another year, while you will remain the same in memory. Father, brother. It is such a mystery, this sword never rusts, even when left in the rain. It seems as if the souls of its masters live within it. Do you not think so, Glenn? Yes. I have engraved in my memory the lives of my father and brother who had wielded the sacred sword Einlanzer. Let us hope that is true. What do you mean by that, Mr. Dell? I cannot allow you even you to. Do you not think there is something odd about the Dragoons of late? Daddy's face shows such anguish, and even Karsh was saying he was sent on a ghost hunt. Mr. Dell. Everyone has been acting oddly ever since that beastly guest arrived at the manor. Glenn, promise me to always keep the unclouded truth in sight. Do not be swayed by the masses. The splendor of the Einlanzer must not be tarnished. As you wish. <laughs> huh? Oh, forgive me. I just found it a little awkward to hear you say such words. <laughs> Miss Riddell, a chill wind has risen. Shall we return to the manor? Yes, of course. Wait. Yeah. And that guy rushed and hit it as soon as I got there. It was a hilarious sight. Yeah, 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 that's great. Oops, I've got customers. Sorry, I'll get you some big fish next time you come by. Alright, Korcha, but are they really going to be big this time? You only ever catch small fry. Your boating skills are first class, but your fishing skills suck. Ah, uh, shut up. See ya. Oh, it's you guys. You're tourists, right? The festival's a waste of time. My name's Kolcha. I'm here from Goldov, working as a ferryman. I can take you anywhere you like with this boat. I take money, but don't worry, it's not that much. My boat and skills are quite famous around here. I guarantee a comfortable ride. We're a little busy, so maybe next time. Alright, if you ever want to get somewhere by boat, swing by. Okay. might you be fortunes be good fortunes be bad anything from reading your destiny to searching for the missing do you wish your fortune to be written nah i'm good for crying out loud don't call me if you have no business i've got things to do i'm like you folks hmm? you well this is interesting you're not dead or anything are you has anybody called you back from the great beyond you just might be the key to the destruction of this entire planet i can't say for sure but fate seems to have a great task for you be careful now boy well, the future is something that only you can create yourself. No need to mind it too much. That is all. Ah, they're not selling at all. A viper festival isn't a viper festival until you have viper churros, right? This isn't going well. It's I'm setting a bad example for my little brother. Shoot, do you think 100G is too much for one churro? Too much. Just as I thought, I had a hunch that it was just a tad too much. How much would you charge for it? 50. Okay, then I'll lower the price a bit to match that. I 
can't remember. Looks like this marketing thing is important, just like my brother said. After lowering the prices you suggested, they started selling them like crazy. If you don't mind leftovers, please have some for yourself. You have taken a Viper Churl. Not bad, and it even revitalizes you. Did you just give me some food that someone else already ate? Master Viper, I'm here to polish your statue again. Alright, all squeaky clean. It's got to be extra clean for the coming festivities. Have you folks come to see the Viper Festival? Uh, Termina is a peaceful thanks to the watchful eye of Master Viper. All times warm, at, at times warm, at times strict, that Master Viper watches over us always. But that said, of course the real Master Viper resides in his manor, along with his Acacia Dragoons. If you allow me to brag a bit, I was invited to the manor a while back. It is a magnificent place. If there is a heaven on earth, that would be it. The manor is beautiful and its designs incorporate the surrounding terrain to its advantage, making it an impenetrable fortress. On top of that, there are powerful soldiers standing guard in front of the main gates who can destroy any monster with just one blow. Well, an upright citizen like myself might get invited to the manor's garden party, but not so for you folks. The most you will get is a cold reception from the gate guards. Ho ho ho! Alright, that's settled. We've got to sneak into Viper Manor. You gotta find out what the Acacia Dragoons are up to, right? And why that Karsh bloke was trying to capture you? I've got some business there as well, so I'll go along with you. But how about it, Lena? Okay, let's go. It's the obvious choice, right? According to Grandpa here, this Viper Manor is a bloody big place, which also means it'll be easy to break into. There's gotta be more than one way in. If we don't plan this right, it'll cost us our lives. Oh yeah, Leonora, I'll leave this in your hands just in case. It's a teleporter. This is a really handy gadget that allows you to exchange party members from afar. The way you use it is... Ah, oh, forget it. Check it out yourself. I hate explaining the details. Kid, join your party. Now I can take her with me or not. I'm gonna not. Alright then, call me anytime. Okay, now we're going to save here because this is a possibility for three different rounds. What I'm going to do actually, this is an important save, so slot two gets a... Uh, remember I'm gonna choose for this playthrough the Nikki route up top. This area is off limits. All non-staff members keep out. I've heard rumors that our sweet Nikki is missing. He couldn't have left me for another girl, could he? Oh, how could you? How awful of you, Nikki. I'm gonna be Nikki's honey bun. Then I will make lots and lots of mud pies for him to eat. Okay. How old are you? Hello? I'm trying to talk. There we go. We are the twin backup dancers. I'm you, and she's me. 
We are just stage support for Nikki and Mickey, but someday we'll take the lead, or we're going to take the lead on the stage. But when will such a day ever come? <sighs> This is my first time visiting Termina, so I was wandering around town promoting the band. Lively town, food's great, all in all, pretty nice place. Concert success seems almost guaranteed, but just between us, the main star Nikki is missing. Have you seen him around? We found him in a daze quite a few times lately. It's like he was here in body, but not in spirit. But man, without him, we're pretty stuck. We can't even start rehearsing for the show. Mickey's supposed to be back soon from searching, but... Hi, Mickey. Mickey, how was it? Did you find him? No, it's no use. I was able to track him up until he went into the Shadow Forest, but there were knights guarding the entrance to the place and I couldn't get in. Besides, I really didn't want to be in those creepy woods on my own. There's supposedly a way into Viper Manor at the end of the forest, but what is that idiot trying to do? I see, so he definitely went into Shadow Forest. Hey, I know. You guys can help me out. I'll lure the knights away from the entrance that you can go into the forest and find Nikki. Pretty please, won't you help out a pretty girl in distress? Now this is one of three paths. Really? Oh, you're a lifesaver. Okay, let's start moving. Unfortunately, if you choose this path, it locks you out of the other two paths. You can't get uh, Guile or Pierre this way. Frankly, I don't like Pierre. I don't think I've ever done his row. But that's just because I don't... I, I hate the way he looks. <laughs> no, we're... She, we're going over to the forest. Hi. We got Fashion Slash now! I just noticed the way he attacks. Oh, well, that's weird. He changed. I don't quite remember how to do this. But, I see that treasure back there, and I want it. Still didn't kill, huh? Darn it! Punch! Slap! Maiden's hand! Slap. <laughs> All right. Okay, I can just walk up to it. 
Arrow Saucer. I think that's the tier one green. Or no, tier two. Tier one was Bushwhacker. Mojo! Whoosh! Good. Dead. Let's see if we can get Mojo's. Buddha dance. Okay then. Hey, there's Nick Nicky. Listen to my song. Oh, 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 sweet sister of mine. Damn it, it's hopeless. Hey, come back. Guarantees a kill. Miss, miss, pop. Luckily, it's on Lena who needs a heal anyway. Wow, that was a lot of damage. Slap him. Damn it, you demons! I can't fend them off alone. Can't remember if this is another boss fight or just a regular. black element attack I have. Oh. He actually was dancing along with it. He's also cursed. Slap him!
I don't know what Curse does in this game, actually. Zap! Photon Ray! Lena, hit him with your spatula. Thank you. I think this was a star. Yep. Hey, three uplifts. Quite uplifting. What, no thank you? Who's that? Apparently he's a real jerk. It's you. What's this? The least you could do is thank us. You're off to Viper Manor, right? Take me with you. Who are you? Actually, there was um, a pooster, uh, a pooster, of you in Termina. What business do you um, have um, in Viper Manor? I believe m my sister is in there. Sister? Anyway, I'll let you in on a secret if you let me join your party. Sure. Rockin'! Nikki joined your band. I'm the Rockin' Bard, Nikki. How about a song? Uh, maybe later. Oh, fine. So, what's um, the secret? In order to get inside Viper Manor, you have to go through the water vein further up. But there's um, a monster block on the way. In order to move it, you have to feed it one of the monsters in the forest. I wasn't quite sure how to lure one to it, but then I noticed this, found this notebook. It says to lure the monster with their favorite food. Favorite food? It's probably talking about the plant life growing in this forest. The plants are attracted to a certain aroma and then emit their pollen. There are to in a total of three monsters in all, each of which has its preference in food. I'll be staying by the port and terminal. Call on me anytime. Well, that's that. Well, let's go. Home. Hey, hey, wait for me. You're just going to leave the treasure there? Confirm. Nikki joins the band. There we go. If someone's going to be talking, I'd rather have it be Nikki than Mr. Voodoo who adds weird crap to the end. Aroma Pouch. Read it. In order to wake up the monster blocking the path, use an aroma pouch and check all the plant life. Some of the plant will be attracted to the aroma. There are monsters in the forest that eat the pollen. Use the pollen. Okay. Once you wake it up, all you have to do is defeat it. But in my case, it defeated me. I leave this helpful note for anyone who wishes to get through. Uh, is one pile different? Angry Scalpula. That's right, I was always pissed off about something. I think I was angry at myself for having no talent. Everyone would just laugh at me or mock me. I hated myself. I'm sure you ain't interested. Let's just get going. Okay, first we go and unequip. Lena. I guess I didn't need to. Mainly, I want to unequip her elements. Okay, um. Arrow saucer. Uplift. Nikki, you can have. Aqua Beam, Ice Lance, Photon Ray, Uplift, oh wait, no, Cure, Uplift can go here, and I guess another Uplift for now, I have an Uplift, we have so many Uplifts, 
Because they just keep dropping. Um... Let's fight it! We have to defeat this thing to get through. Why didn't we just fight it while it was sleeping? I'm pretty sure this might be another star fight. Slash and dash! Or dash and slash. Nikki, you're up. Oof. That was a lot of damage. Grand finale. <laughs> I love that. Photo dance. Go, Mojo. Already done. Oh, no, that wasn't a star. It's just a monster. All right, what I'm going to do is back out and save it well if I can get through this fight but I'm pretty sure I'm fine Die, plant! I normally, I think, when I uh, go through this, play or choose the Guile route. So this is going to be interesting. call it here thank you all for watching hopefully you have enjoyed hope uh if you have be sure to leave a like comment and subscribe and remember Escalates, share the love goodbye thank you guys for watching and a huge thank you to my patrons without you guys i wouldn't be able to make the content i do and do what i love to do so thank you very much and i'll see you guys in the next video goodbye